I'm always amazed at how many national holidays there are. But I'm not talking about the federally recognized ones like Memorial Day, Independence Day, Labor Day, Veterans Day. I'm not talking about those. I'm talking about the really obscure national holidays like National Hot Dog Day or National Pizza Day. There's even a National Talk Like a Pirate Day. Who knew? Well, just recently, we celebrated two of those obscure national holidays, if you will. This last Saturday was National Daughters Day. And just yesterday, it was National Sons Day. Well, I don't really celebrate National Daughters Day because I don't have any daughters of my own. But I do have two sons that I love very much. And so yesterday, National Sons Day, was a great day for me to reflect on the wonderful blessings that are my two sons, Jeffrey and Benjamin. Well, did you know that you are a son of God or a daughter of God? It's true. And God celebrates you every day. Listen to what God says in 2 Corinthians 6, verse 18. He says, I will be a father to you. And you will be my sons and daughters, says the Lord Almighty. Think about that. You are a son of God. You are a daughter of God. You are God's prized possession. And he loves you very, very much. As a matter of fact, God loves you so much that he sent his son, our brother, Jesus Christ, to die on the cross and wash away all of our sins. And so because our brother Jesus Christ lived, died, and rose for us, God now brings us into his family. He is our father and we are his sons and daughters. And one day we will look forward to the greatest family reunion there is, where we, as sons and daughters of God, will live forever with our father in perfect paradise. So I pray that you were able to celebrate National Daughters Day and National Sons Day, and I pray that you reflect on the wonderful blessings that are sons and daughters. But I also want you to rejoice that you are a son and daughter of God Almighty. He loves you very much. He's the best father we could ask for. And one day, he's gonna bring us home to heaven. And that's gonna be awesome. If this devotion has been a blessing to you, please like and share with others. God's blessings to you all.